25 miles an hour going into the wind. It's supposed to be a light breeze. It's more like a uh, storm has gone through and stirred up the air is what it is. Get pushed around a little bit. The wind is uh, shifting. Everything that's uh, windy forecasted as well as UAV and about three other isn't quite holding true. So it's one of those days that you come out and you put your thumb, lick your thumb and put it in the air and stick your uh, wet sock up in the air and watch the corn and everything else and just rely on your instincts and your what you see. So yeah, it's one of those days. So it's kind of like one of those days where you think it's going to be really windy and you you stay at home and then uh, 5, 6, 7 o'clock, an hour before sunset, it just stops and it's beautiful. And if you don't go out and do some parawading, you're going to miss out on a beautiful flight. As we can see, the uh, soybeans are being harvested. It's kind of interesting watching the uh, smoke or the dust coming up because the dust is going the opposite way of what the wind forecast says. It should be kind of coming the other way. It looks like it's uh, it's coming up towards the tail and then switching back. So they're harvesting pumpkins. So we're going to go look at the harvest, the pumpkins, all set up, ready to get picked. They bunch them all up in a line. I don't see any of the pickers out here. But there they are, all lined up in pretty rows. Looks like a big long runway we all lit up with lights. Looks like a lot of them get damaged. See some smashed ones down there. Still a little uh, bouncy here. I'll get down a little bit lower, but get bounced quite a bit. Pick one, anyone. Here we got all sorts of pumpkins. You know, I probably could land and put one in my lap. Wonder what kind of damage I could do by running into a pumpkin. Thirty feet, thirty-two miles an hour. Just kind of following David around. like they're picking corn as well. Not right now, but uh, this below us is corn, so it's getting picked. Follow your shadow down there, go sideways.
watch out for the rotor over these trees. Do a touch and go out here on this soybean field. It, it, we won't touch their land. We'll just fly right above it. And it drops off right here. where David went. There he is. Let's do another pumpkin run and then over to the uh, four-wheeler track. Could land right here go grab a pumpkin. To the pumpkin. Oh, a little wobbly here. If I was Tucker God, I'd have somebody on the ground throwing pumpkins up at me, hitting me in the shin. But I'd have to outdo that one. I'd have to light the pumpkin on fire and throw it up and hit me. some lonely pumpkins down here. They must have forgot them. Maybe these are the best fit pumpkins down here. by the hog building. They got these fans turned on and it blows out the smell from the hogs. You go by, your wing gets tipped and you smell like hog. Whew, boy that stinks. <coughs> My goodness. Going with the wind.
going with the wind, uh, 32, but not getting a whole lot of lift. I go ahead and pull the trims up, get some lift. I haven't seen any deer. I guess I haven't really been looking either. But it is deer season here. At least for a bow. If you're a bow hunter. Forty-seven hundred RPMs. Trims all the way in. Thirty-one miles an hour. Two hundred twenty-two feet in the air. Traveling south. Not seeing any aircraft in the area.